so here is the set of nails um, I did using dried flowers so um, I've done my usual I've removed her previous set down to a thin clear base I've then done all my natural nail work prep I'm then coming in with a thin clear base of clear acrylic um, as you notice her pointer finger is smaller than the others that's deliberate she requests it that way so before anyone says you've done that one shorter I haven't I do it like that because that's how she wants it So starting off at the pinky finger and I'm coming in with Cola Cubes from CJP. I bought this ages ago and I just put it straight in the drawer and totally forgot about it. And I got it out again the other day and oh my god, it is so pretty. So I'm using this a lot at the moment because I think it is honestly just gorgeous. Um, so I'm using this as a full colour nail. So I've applied that small bead and then I'm blending down the nail. I did find it marbled a little bit, but if you work the acrylic quite well, the marble comes out quite easily and as you can see there I kind of flipped the bead as well so um, it, it does marble a little but nothing nothing you can't work with and then once I've done the base colour I'm then coming in with my wet brush and picking up some of the pink and the copper chrome flakes and just placing them on the nail in my usual kind of um, swirl across the nail I'm happy with the design capping in clear acrylic Then moving on to the ring finger and this one I'm using coconut ice as the base so um, I'm going to make sure I get a nice cuticle line and then I'm going to pull that down the nail so I've got a nice solid base uh, to then add my design on. Then using my wet brush to pick up some of those copper flakes, placing them on the nail, and then using my wet brush to pick up some of these dried flowers. These are from the Glitter Fairy. I think they've all sold out now, I'm afraid. Sorry, guys. But um, yeah, I just used uh, dried flowers um, using small beads of wet clear acrylic just to make sure my base was nice and sticky, adding on a few different flowers. And then when I'm happy with the design, I'm going to cap this nail in clear acrylic. Then on to the next nail, I'm going to do an ombre using the Coda Cubes and Coconut Ice. So I'm starting off with Coda Cubes at the tip and blending up. And then I'm going to get the Coconut Ice at the cuticle area and blend down.
And then when I'm happy with this blend, I'm then going to use my wet brush to pick up some more of those flowers. I'm going to place a few clear, um, a few clear flowers, a few dried flowers on the nail, and then add a few flakes as well before then capping in clear acrylic. And then on the pointer finger and on the thumb, I did the same as I did on the little finger. So Kona cubes as a base and then some of the um, chrome flakes. all finished i filed them in and then oh my camera just would not focus so i'm applying top coat and then i'm going to apply some cuticle oil once the top coat has cooled down And there you go guys, that is the set complete. This is a really nice springtime set. Again, Cola Cubes will definitely be used more. Now I've kind of rediscovered it. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the set. I hope you're all keeping safe and well, and I hope to see you all again soon. See you later. Bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video guys if you want to see more like this remember to head on over to my channel click the subscribe button and make that bell ring and then you'll get notifications every time i share a new video thanks for tuning in